This is our Creative Electron True View Inspection System. It's an x-ray machine. Uh, over here we have our main power switch as well as the main x-ray enabling key. Uh, without this being on, you cannot perform any x-rays. Uh, you can see on either side of the machine there are two arms where we can do reel-to-reel x-raying, which is taking an actual reel, running it through the system, and x-raying it, seeing the images on the screen. You can also see the orange conveyor belts. Uh, once we open up this door, we can load a tray or a tube uh, into the system on the platform inside to perform our x-rays. And we have a joystick, which we can zoom in and out. The red button is our emergency shutoff. And let's go ahead and load a part so we can perform an x-ray. We'll open the door because we're going to x-ray a tube. We'll insert the tube into the platform, close the door, and choose a program. Uh, for tubes we'll, and trays, we'll use the TrueView conveyor. program opens, we go ahead and activate our x-ray source. As you can see, the units that we loaded previously, uh, we're now x-raying, and this unit here on the far left does not have a die present in the center of the unit. The lead frame is also different than the unit in the middle. Uh, the unit in the middle, the die is a little bit smaller than the unit on the far right, and also that lead frame is also different than the unit in the middle. All three units are the same part numbers. All three units have different die frame, uh, excuse me, different lead frames. Um, one has no die and two has two different size die. Therefore, we will deem this order to be suspect counterfeit.